Hey everyone, it's Ashley from Polly Vegan Kitchen and today we are making a turmeric juice. Now unlike the usual juices that we make, this juice is processed by boiling the ingredients of this recipe that will in turn yield a potent golden juice that we refer to as turmeric juice or in Tongan, Vayangango. Due to the fact that the preparation of this juice is time consuming, please refer back to our Facebook page for its benefits. This recording is for demonstration purposes only. In this recipe, you will need two pounds of turmeric, two pounds of ginger, 10 bulbs of garlic, one aloe vera leaf, eight lemons, four cinnamon sticks, a few stalks of lemongrass, and four gallons of water. Peel, cut, and wash your turmeric and ginger. Peel and wash all the garlic. Wash and cut all the lemons. Wash all your lemongrass and on the bottom, lightly pound it. Peel and take out as much of the flesh from the aloe vera plant as possible. This is optional, but it would be ideal to cut your turmeric and ginger so that it's easier to pulse in the blender. Since we're using four gallons of water, it is ideal to find a big stainless steel pot to process this juice. The water that we're using today is Arrowhead distilled water, but feel free to use the water that you prefer in your own home. Into the pot, we are pouring two gallons of water. We will save the other two for the blending and pulsing that we will do in the blender. Into the pot, we are going to add our lemongrass and our lemon pieces. Also, we will be adding the four cinnamon sticks. Into the blender, we have added some water and also our aloe vera. There's no set amount of water. It's just enough to get the blender going. The aloe vera is the only ingredient that you will fully blend until it's liquid form. As we continue to blend all the ingredients, we will add them to the pot. Please take note that the rest of the ingredients will be pulsed and not blended into a liquid form. As we continue to process our juice, 
I just wanted to share a verse that I felt very touched with today. Taken from Jeremiah 17, verse 14. Heal me, O Lord, and I shall be healed. Save me, and I shall be saved, for thou art my praise. Oftentimes we go through the ups and downs of life, and sometimes we are stricken with diseases and sicknesses that tend to overwhelm us. It is in these times that God is willing and waiting to hear from us. I would like to encourage you to turn to him for it is only through God that we will find healing and true peace. This juice recipe is not our own. It has been circulating Facebook and among our Tongan community. So we decided to put together a demonstration. Some people might use this juice differently and process it differently as well. Feel free to use your own judgment on how you wish to process and use this juice for your own benefit. Just a reminder that we are not doctors or nutritionists. We are only sharing this recipe as it has been a helping aid to my family and many others who drink this juice. Bear in mind that one man's food is another man's poison. So as always, use precaution when you try new things. As you can see, the blending is done and we are using the remaining water from the four gallons to rinse out the blender. And now it is time to boil. Once you have a rolling boil, let it continue to boil for 10 to 15 minutes. Then turn the stove down to its lowest and let it simmer for 45 minutes. For adults, you can drink this for general health maintenance, one cup a day, either in the morning or in the evening. Here's our final product after turning the stove off for 10 minutes. Notice there are no longer any ingredients floating at the top. Once your juice is at room temperature, strain and put your juice into containers and refrigerate. My taste tester is in Hawaii this morning and she is sipping on her turmeric juice as she tours the island. Thank you for joining us today. Please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. And don't forget we are on Facebook and Instagram. No matter where you are on this journey, there's always room for you on our table. Thank you for watching.